Okay. All right, everybody. I get numerous, numerous questions about Canadian milk bags. For those of you who don't know it, um, at least here in Ontario, when you buy a gallon of milk, you buy it in a bag like this. And this is four liters, which is roughly a gallon. You can buy milk in cartons, two liter cartons, or one liter cartons as well, but you won't find a gallon jug of milk in Ontario. I can't say for the rest of the provinces, but at least in Ontario, Canada, this is how you buy your milk if you want to buy big quantities of it. So, this is the milk bag, which is about a gallon. It's divided inside here, I'm going to show you. You open this up, there's a little, one of these little ties on there and it has the uh, expiry date on it. You open it up and inside are three of these bags. There's three of them, they're 1.33 liters each. And these are made with plastic and they are extremely tough. They're very, very tough, so they're not fragile in any sense of the imagination. You can drop these and they won't break, and they're sealed, as you can see. So, this is the milk container. I just, this is the empty bag. So you take out your empty bag, and you rinse these out, and these are recyclable. And as you can see, they don't, you know, they don't take up too much space in the trash if you're not gonna recycle them. They're just little, little bag. Okay, so take your plastic container, now, everyone has to buy their own plastic container, but as you can see, these are gonna last a really long time. They're very durable. You can get them in, they're inexpensive. The dollar store. You can get them at the dollar store, and they come in a variety of colors, so you can get the color you want. So you take your new milk bag, and then you just put it in the container. And I give it a little tap to make sure it's down to the bottom. And I straighten out the top like this, and you can use a pair of scissors for this, but this particular container comes with this little thing that we call a snippet. It actually says snippet, that's the name brand. And it's a little razor blade in there. You can actually open, use this to open other things too. Like mail? But we usually keep it for just milk because it's clean and it's only used for milk. And that way, you know, when it touches the milk bag, you're not adding any nasty germs on there. So you just grab the end of the bag and then you just snip off the end. And the size of the hole at the end of the bag, you can, oh, there's the phone. There's, there's the phone. Okay, now the size of the hole, you can vary to your preference. So if you're only pouring milk into coffee, you might want a small hole. And if you want to fill up a glass of milk quickly, you'll put a larger hole, that's a preference. And there you go, goes into the fridge. The container is solid, it doesn't flop over very very much, and you can just store the little snippet right there. And what's nice about it is that your, the rest of your milk stays sealed and fresh in the refrigerator because you only have one liter out at a time. So there you go, there is... There is the mystery of the milk bag solved. And then you just, you just oh. pour. There you go.